Development has been announced for downtown Jacksonville. You're taking a live look uh, right now over the airport here. And there's a look at our skyline where nearby TIAA Bank Field, that entire area, that landscaped around it, we're talking Lot J, expected to change. Now, this is an aerial view from Action News Jack's Sky uh, Vision drone here, giving you an exterior look at Lot J there. What it looks like now you can see it's a parking lot next to a retention pond but this is what you can expect in the future for lot J and this rendering we've highlighted and zoomed in on a live entertainment venue set to be built next to the football stadium and Daly's place Action News Jack's Russell Colburn live downtown and Russell no exact construction timeline has been announced yet yeah, but we know an agreement has been reached, and this will result in a more than $450 million capital investment. And we can zoom you on out to give you a look at Lot J, this expansive parking lot here in front of TIAA Bank Field, where we're told all this will go. And we can give you another look at those renderings. Of course, the condos, hotels, and entertainment complex developers say will make up Lot J. We also have a labeled look from above showing where the live arena, office space, expanded parking area, and more will be be added. We're told this is an agreement between the city, the Jags, and Shad Khan's Iguana Investments. Action News Jacks also confirmed the Cordish companies is involved as well. They're known for creating live spaces that will feature entertainment, food, and retail. Today we tried to speak with Mayor Lenny Curry and the Jags, but we're told Curry and President Mark Lamping were unavailable for interviews. But in a statement, Mayor Curry said in part, this development and the removal of the elevated expressway will add to our capacity to develop the downtown Town riverfront and will position Jacksonville for world class events that we simply cannot compete for today. And you're looking live now, of course, at the Hart Bridge Expressway. Those are the ramps Mayor Curry mentioned in his statement. We are also hearing from the Jags on this. We'll have their statement for you coming up all new at 6. But for now, reporting live downtown, Russell Colburn, CBS 47 Action News Jax. All right, Action News Jax wants to know what you think about the plans. We have a live poll asking, are you most excited for live entertainment, new restaurants, housing, or none of the above? So far, 53% of you say new restaurants. So let us know at actionnewsjax.com slash vote.